Hello, check. Microphone test. Oh, hey, what's up, guys? This is Vimal here, and welcome back to TRHD. You guys might be thinking what I'm doing with this boom stand and a wooden microphone. You've guessed it right, guys. This microphone is built by me just using a business card, a coil, and a magnet. Isn't it pretty awesome? The audio quality is awesome, right, guys? You're hearing me right through it. I've connected this microphone to my camera using this pin. So in today's video, I'll show you guys a step-by-step -step procedure on how to make this microphone at your home. Check, one, two, three, okay. Okay, let's start making this microphone, guys. These are the components you need to make this microphone. You need a magnet. This is how the magnet looks like. You can get this from any old speaker or you can even purchase it online from eBay. You need a voice coil. You can make your own voice coil at your home. It is very easy to make one. You just need some paper and a 40 gauge copper wire. You need to wind this 40 gauge copper wire onto this paper. You need to, you need to wind approximately 200 turns. I won't be showing you how to make this voice coil because it will take some time. You need one business card which will act as a diaphragm and you need a 3.5mm socket which is used to connect the microphone to the camera. So let's start making one. Now you need to attach the coil to the diaphragm. Cut the paper as I am doing. Now bend the paper. You need to apply glue over the paper and stick it to the diaphragm. This is how the coil should look like. Now apply glue over it. Now stick this coil to the diaphragm just like this. And hold it firmly. So this is how the diaphragm will look like after attaching the coil to it. Now take a metal strip, you need to attach the magnet to this metal strip. Take a piece of tape and attach the metal strip to the magnet, just like this. Now you need to bend the metal strip. Bend the metal strip just like this. Watch carefully. This is how it should look like. Now you need to attach the metal strip and the magnet to a wooden stick. We are using this wooden stick to hold the microphone. Just use a screw and a watcher to fix the metal strip into the wooden stick. Now put some extra tape over it so that it won't move. This is how it should look like. Now we need to fix the diaphragm over the magnet and we need to align the coil in its correct position. Use pieces of tape and attach the diaphragm to the metal strip. It is very easy to do this guys, just watch carefully. Now take two pieces of wires and attach them to this wooden handle. Stick the tape at two to three places so that they'll hold the wires firmly. Now bend the wire in this way so that you can solder these wires to the leads of the voice coil easily. Now solder the ends of the wires to the voice coil. Solder the black wire to one end of the voice coil. Now solder the red wire to the other end of the voice coil. The soldering part is done guys, this is how the microphone looks like. Now take the 3.5mm phono socket. We need to solder the red and black wires to this socket. Tin the tips of the socket and solder the wires. This is how it should look like. Now fix the socket to the handle using a piece of tape in a comfortable position. The assembling part of the microphone is done guys. This is how the microphone looks like. Now we are ready to test the microphone. 
Now let's test the microphone by connecting it to my camera. Let's connect this microphone using this 3.5mm jack. Just plug it into this socket. Can you hear it guys? Hello, check. 1, 2, 3. Microphone test. How is it guys? Isn't it awesome? A microphone using a business card. It's pretty awesome guys. Thanks guys for watching my video. Now you can make your own microphone at your home. Hit the thumbs up button, subscribe and stay tuned to my channel for more new awesome videos.